Luke, Luke, I am your father. Hey, second graders. Just a little Star Wars bit for you all. It's time for math. All right. This is all review. All week is review. All right. We will review counting money. And we have some word problems. I know they're your favorite. You might ask mom and dad to help you on some of the word problems. Maybe. Maybe not. Try and do them without asking for help. But let's try and get them done. All right. First of all, count money. We know how to do this, right? Nickels are worth five cents. Nickel, nickel, nickel. Nickel. Oh, we know how to count by fives, right? Five, 10, 15, 20. Remember how to do these? The numbers here, we're just adding them up. And then give me the total over here. Remember if it's over $1 or over 100 cents, you need to put that on this side of the little dot. It's called the decimal. You need to put that on the other side. And that decimal means dollar. So if I have $1.20, it's 1.20, right? Right? If I have one dollar and twenty cents, it is one dot two zero four. It's the same as a hundred and twenty cents. You guys should remember that, but just thought I'd touch base. So you can get your math done. Front and back. You should be able to get through it pretty quickly, except the word problems might take you a little time. Make sure you read them. And try to understand what it's asking, okay? Do your best. Read through them, okay? We've used lots of different ways to try and remember what the question is asking. So get through your math and then have a snack, eat lunch, or then enjoy some time off. Help mom with some chores, help dad with some chores, um, and that sort of thing. So. Then you can come back and we'll do a read aloud. Now remember, next week the read alouds are going to be a little different. We're going to go back to our book and actually learn about President Lincoln on the first one. Because remember, that's what we were studying before. But this week we're having a little bit more fun, a little more relaxed about it. I think you'll like the read aloud. You've, um, you've heard it before. So anyway, get your math done and we'll be in touch here in a little while.